Laura Bailey. I'm the Chief Engineer and SDNI Lead for the Deep Space Habitat Project. At a fairly early age, I was interested in flight and in space in general. By the time I was in high school, I started realizing I had a propensity for math and science that I veered into engineering and into specifically into aerospace engineering. What's mostly involved in being Chief Engineer and SDNI Lead on the project is to have a good focus on what technologies are the leading candidates uh, for various subsystems uh, on the project that meet our agenda and schedule, as well as a lot of coordination and making sure that we're all playing on the same, with the same goals in mind and meeting towards the same end. The greatest challenge to the deep space facility or to any facility in deep space really is the issue of galactic cosmic radiation controls and how do we best handle that because the duration of stay in space during space travel, the time that we're there and the time of return um, is at such a length that proper controls really need to be in place that are not currently defined. I had the opportunity to steer and lead an effort to produce not only tile repair concepts but and bring those to, to fruition for flight that was used throughout the remaining of the space shuttle program, but also to lead the effort and resolve the problem as to whether or not we could access the vehicle using the 50-foot boom. I led the effort to build a simulator to emulate those conditions, and we showed that that could be done. And then later we followed on with a, an on-orbit experiment that validated my test facility for that. So. Um, it was a very exciting time, and uh, I'm grateful that I had the opportunity to do that. Well, I feel extremely fortunate, actually. I feel very blessed, in fact, uh, because I've had a great career experience. I've um, gotten to work with some of the smartest brains in the world, and I've gotten to work in a spacesuit in zero gravity, in the pool, in 1G, on the air bearing floor, and lots of different environments like that. You know, there's one thing that can't be traded for any of the education or background experience that you have, and that is that you just care. You care sincerely in your heart about the work that you're doing, and that you're here, and you're very much purpose-driven, and nobody can take that away from you, and it can't be replaced.